Hey, y'all. Um, we actually got off at a normal time today. And look, I got home and my the lounge, the wave had come in. And I went pretty fast and I didn't separate it a lot. You know, I just wanted to try it out before I did my live. But I'm in love with it. I wanted my hair to have that beachy wave when we go to the beach. So, y'all drop a comment and tell me what you think about it. I have wanted this really like since it came out. I have watched it back before I had internet. I would watch like info commercials and uh, I love it. It, it. it really is. It really is hot. So if you ever get one, don't get it too close to your head because I probably have a blister about right there. But uh, I'm pretty excited about that. Tonight we have an opportunity zoom at eight o'clock. If you're interested in going as my guest, let me know and um, I will send you the number to push in for the Zoom call. Um, opportunity Zooms, you can always learn so much. You will hear things that you don't know, of course. I'm going to be there and um, I will I always learn no matter what the Zoom is about. But this is an opportunity Zoom. Because this month, for $48, you can sign up to be a beauty guide. And um, in return for that $48, you get your website, which is where your green room will be, where you'll go to, um, where your customers will go to purchase from you. Um, it'll, it pays your $9.99 fee for the month. And the week later, you will have $150 to spend on whatever you want to build your kit so if you have thought about being a beauty guide really work and really be a beauty guide then um i encourage you to join me on this zoom tonight this opportunity zoom and if you would like to uh, send me a message and i will send you the number to put in for the the code to get into our zoom at eight o'clock tonight um, so I'm going to start and I'm getting ready now that I've shown y'all my hair all wavy. I love it so much. Um, if you're watching, please drop a comment. Um, it really helps if you share and um, hit those little hearts and stuff. It it just does. Okay, normally, did I bring it in here with me? I thought I did. I went in the living room just to get my sunblock, and I do not see it. Well, I'm, I will tell y'all, um, right now I'm going to use my primer spray, because. but if it was in the morning and I was going to be outside at all, or if, like, right now I was getting dressed to go outside and spend time, I would not use my primer spray. I wouldn't even have used my moisturizer. I would use my sunblock, the perfect sunblock for my face, um, it has primer. It is a primer for your makeup. It is a moisturizer and it is 30 SPF sunblock. So our sunblocks are great. So uh, just to let you know, in the mornings before we go anywhere, I don't use my priming spray. I will use my sunblock for my face and it is a primer. Um, our, our first base makeup primer has uh, anti-aging nutrients and moisturizers in it. And it's just very important because it kind of fills in the little creases and, and you know, like the creases around my mouth and stuff. It builds a, a barrier on there where the makeup will sit on the primer instead of in my face. So I'm saying it won't like soak in. It'll sit on the primer. And it has these little molecular buildup where it keeps your face cool all day. Like all day. I just always imagine it like champagne bubbles or Sprite bubbles or something, you know, just kind of burst in a little cool all day long. That's the way it keeps it on your face so well, too. So the primer, our primer and our finish spray is very, very important. But if you use, if you get our face sunblock, you will not have to use your, your primer spray or your moisturizer in the morning because the sunblock is a moisturizer and the primer. And um, I'll just start out with, let's say I got my primer on, it's dry. Um, I just took a shower, I used my Dew Confidence. I love my Dew Confidence. It, it helps get rid of uh, 
turkey neck, you know, when you get older and your neck kind of droops. And uh, these wrinkles in my forehead, the top two have already started to relax a little bit. This bottom one is going to be hard to do. It's so, so deep because I'm very animated when I talk. But I've been putting it on my legs, my Do Confidence. It helps to get rid of cellulite. And um, I don't want to have a bunch of cellulite in the summertime um, or any time. So while I'm in the shower, while my legs are still damp, I rub my due confidence on the tops of my legs, wherever the cellulite is. And then I got out and I I used my eye rise because I, I use it in the morning and at night. And since I was going to do a live late this evening, I'll probably sleep in my makeup because I'm going to have my finishing spray on, my time setter spray on. It'll keep my makeup on for 16 hours. So I'll just sleep in it. So I went ahead and did my eye rise too. But um, I used my... Um, well, I'll show you the bottle looks like this. This is my empty one. One drop winder. It has, you push it like that, and then you can open it up, and it literally has a dropper, and you just use one drop on your face, and uh, it's a face oil, and then it intensifies your face. I mean, it intensifies anything else you use, and our bottles for our um, skin therapy and our Sotox are this size. This is my other, my skin therapy bottle. My full ones are in the bathroom. But I use my One Drop Wonder, my Skin Therapy, and my Sotox. Sotox has gotten rid of the black under eye. So, and I sit on my foundation. That's why I talked a little bit longer so uh, it could warm up. It's wax based. And uh, as you see, mine is getting a little empty. I have another full one. But um, you can melt these down. You can put like a pan. Okay, everything we have... And this is for recycling purposes. We reuse our cartridges, okay? You just order a refill so it's not waste. But you can put like a pan in the oven at 400 degrees just long enough for it to get hot. You take the pan out and then you take these out, sit them on the pan, and they'll slowly just kind of melt and then it'll be all over the bottom of it, which is pretty cool. Hey, Tashara. Um hit that s button i think it's on that side it may be on hit all the buttons for me girl and hey i was just telling y'all how to melt down the foundation when it gets on the edges like that but right now i'm just gonna go ahead that's why i use this sometimes this is my little brush our foundation is wax based and it's a uh, 50 percent pigmented it's double any other foundation you're gonna find okay thank you to shara you're hooking me up so, uh, I'm just going to get it on this one, and I dab it down my foundation on so it warms up to my face, which I was already sitting on it, so it's pretty warm. But since it's wax-based, you want it to warm up to your face. And, y'all, my phone is cracked. It accidentally fell off the sawhorses the other day. So, I'm going to be looking in my mirror because... I see a lot of cracks when I look at my phone. I was going to go get another one today, but we just didn't. That was already all the way in another town. We were we went to Glenwood today. David finished uh, pressure washing the high parts of this house that we're going to stain. So we didn't have a real long day, which was great. But as you see, I'm just dabbing this on. I could just get my big brush and, um, you know, wipe it on my face kind of pounce, pounce, pounce it, and I let it warm up to my face, and then rub it in, but I did it this way today. Hey, Tammy, hit all the buttons on the bottom. Leslie, you too. I would appreciate it. It helps me. Okay, I'm going in with my number 17 brush. This is a Limelight Falcone brush. It is professional, um, handmade. It is vegan, and where you see, it's supposed to be white, but it's got a little foundation on it. Um, it's it doesn't pick up very much foundation because you don't need very much of our foundation because because it is 50% pigmented and it is a weighted brush where I can hold it at the end and it will lightly rub my foundation in. The brush you use to do your foundation, which of course I didn't realize what a difference it made until I bought professional brushes. 
and it really does make a huge difference how your foundation even goes on. I always thought people were full of it, but they're not. <laughs> Everything I've learned through the years, now I'm applying it, and it makes my makeup look so much better. And this is just my foundation. If you watch this on replay, could you please um, comment hashtag replay, and that'll help. It helps move me around a lot. Okay, I also sit on my concealer. This is my concealer 03. This is more of my flesh color, okay? I use concealer zero everywhere else, but my concealer three, I use under my eyes to cover whatever my foundation didn't, which I didn't really put very much foundation under my eyes because I come in with my concealer. And I come down low because I don't want to accentuate what I'm hiding, which is this right here. So I come down low, and then I will go in and blend it. And it doesn't take a lot of our concealer. Our concealer is waterproof. Summer's coming up. If you go swimming, it will not come off. Your concealer will not. So, like, in the summer, I'll use a lot of the flesh-colored, my flesh-colored concealer, because it is waterproof and I'll come out looking like I looked when I went in so I just use the L3 underneath my eyes I'll go ahead and put it on top too because our concealer has priming agents in it so I'm priming my eyelids for my eyeshadow and yeah I'm looking back here behind my phone I'm looking at my Ricky mirror they're available through my side my my links in my bio my site is in my bio if y'all want to just go window shop or whatever. And um, if you need a color match, contact me and I will send you the color match to quiz. You, this is concealer zero to highlight. But I'll send you the color match quiz and the answer it gives you, you can send it to me with a picture of you about three feet away from a window in natural light, no makeup on, no filters, and make sure your neck and your chest shows because you want to match your foundation to your neck and your chest so your face doesn't look so white. And uh, we can get you color match, get you the perfect color uh, foundation, our perfect color powder that goes with the foundation, what color um, concealer would go better with your skin color to hide, you know, like if you have age spots or blemishes that you would like to cover a little better. Because our concealer will cover up a zit. It really will. But yeah, if you want a color match, just let me know. This is the number 5 brush. It is the baby number 17. Number 17 is out of stock still. But there is a number 16 that is just like the 17. It's just shaped more like this. It's more of an oval shape. The number 5 just came back in today. So you can order the number 5 brush. You can use this for a foundation or a concealer brush. I use it for my concealer. And you can see how well it blends. It does not pick up my foundation. It just blends in my concealer. And see, I have that zero on my nose and my forehead. I really just love to highlight my T-zone is what I like to do. And then I'll go in with some bronzer and do some concealer go ahead and make sure my little triangles are gone so there my foundation is done I'll do my eyebrows real quick this is a claim to frame brow pencil um, in 03 this is the darkest one it comes in a light medium and dark I use the dark one, of course. I'm black-headed, except for that, look at that one piece of gray right there. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> I'm getting ready for an opportunity Zoom. Uh, if anyone is interested in uh, joining me for the Zoom, contact me, and I will give you the number to get in our Zoom. And you can watch our opportunity event Zoom, and... um. 
being a beauty guide part-time, full-time, anytime, maybe something you've thought of doing and you're just really not sure where to start to make extra money. Like, for those of you who have known me forever, y'all know I haven't always been able to order a Lange La Wave, okay? Me doing this on the side, selling Lime Life um, skincare and makeup, has made it where when I really want something, I can really get it. I have wanted that Lange La Wave since they came out with it. And I never thought I could afford it. But now I have my own little bit of money here on the side from Lime Life. And it helped. It really helped so much. And just like Christopher's um, class ring. Which a little booger. He's so sweet. He went ahead and got the less expensive one anyway. But I was gonna. I was able to let him get the. It was $850 ring. Because you know gold is outrageous right now. Well, he told me that he decided not to spend that much money because, I mean, he's just smart. Smarter than most kids. But the opportunity that Heather gave me, inviting me to be a beauty guide, has enabled me to be able to say, yes, you can have an $850 ring. So if you're interested in maybe becoming a beauty guide, full-time or part-time, um, get in touch with me, and I'll send you that number so you can hop on the Zoom. It's at 8 o'clock tonight. I'll be there. Okay, I go in with my translucent powder anywhere I highlight it. Anywhere I put concealer, I go in with my translucent powder, and I use my perfect color powder for everywhere else. Um, this came in our maze box. This is one of the things that came in an maze box. I have so many things that came in the maze box. Our maze box is a subscription box. It is $42 a month, free shipping every month, and you're guaranteed $50 to $100 in product. The highest I had was over $129 in a box, though, and the lowest I've had was right at like $60, bucks. and it's free shipping every month. This is a surprise. I love my maze box. It really is amazing. I know it's in this month, so... I know it's pretty nice. There are perks of being a beauty guy because you know ahead of time a little bit. But um, last, I guess this is last month, we got the uh, Bamboo Renew Body Scrub. And it's a body exfoliator. And I, I love it. It really helps. And before you shave, if you use that exfoliator, you will get the closest shave on your legs. It just feels so good. Um, this is the perfect color powder. This is in nude. That's what color I, I have. I have bamboo to go when I use olive three. I have my nude um, when I'm using my Shinto one, Shinto two. I put it everywhere I did not put my translucent powder. And if you notice, I press pressed powder. And our perfect color powder has uh, blurring agents in it. It's 63% pigmented. And it blurs out any little fine lines that you want to blur out. It's almost like a filter for your face. Hey, Deborah. Hey, Tasha, you know what to do. Hit all the buttons. And Thad, hit all the buttons. Thank you, Tasha. I bought the um, Lange uh, La Wave. I, I finally ordered it. That's why I was telling them that um, me doing being a beauty guide on the side has made it where I can order things like that for myself. I love it. This is the bronzer. This is bronzer 01. Pretty sure 01. Yeah, bronzer 01. This came in an amaze box. Um, I use it to contour. And like I was saying, the uh, amaze box is $42 a month, free shipping. And the first time you order an amaze box, a subscription, anything else you have in your cart that you buy with the amaze box, with the subscription, you get free um, shipping with that. So, that's awesome, because shipping will get you. It will sure get... Thank you, Thad, for sharing. That's sweet. And you say, I came in here, and this uh, bronzer, it really slims your face. It really does. 
and I go under right on the edge here to hide a little double chin. You can come down like this. I've seen people come down and just shade it into a darker, but it just darkens that and it just slims your whole face down. I'll go ahead and I'm going to do, I'll do my nose for y'all. I get a kick out of doing my nose anyway. It, it really does look good. I was watching, looking at some of my videos today that I have on, uh, I have another page, it's Jessica's Beauty Mark. And I was looking, watching it, and I thought, my nose looks good in that one. And uh, I had contoured my nose. When you do contouring, I use the bronzer uh, one, like I used to do here and under my chin and everywhere. I just, like, follow my eyebrows down where they would go, where they go. And I come down like this. If you want your nose to look thinner, you put the lines closer together. If you want your nose to look wider, you put the lines further apart. But I just follow my eyebrows down to where I think it would land. And I use this bronzer. To bronze my nose and it really makes it look more defined and then I'll use my blender full and I'll just pat it out but it see how it slimmed my nose down it has slimmed my face down and that is our bronzer 01 I just use it for my contouring and then I'll pat this in a little bit Yes, I do a little touch up. Some people just leave it like that. I like to touch up and it not be so obvious that I did it. It just gives me that little bit of contouring. Well, Deborah, I have a little bit of one, so I just hide it. I hide it with my contour. <laughs> but thank you. Uh, yeah, Trey, look what Trey said. He said hit all them buttons. Okay. I have my face done, okay? I have my powder on, my perfect color powder. I have my translucent powder on. And then I did my contouring with my bronzer 01. So now I will start with my eyeshadow. I think I'm going to do a purple eyeshadow tonight. I like purple. I'll start out with the black. I like my black. Y'all know I do. And I have... Okay, I have hooded eyes. Most people would go right in their crease with colors. But when I open my eyes, you cannot see my crease. So I go above my crease. I'm just barely dabbing into this black because all of our makeup is so highly pigmented. I don't want to overdo it. So I just barely dab. And I'll, I'll come in, I'll blend my purple up. I just like to put this black. It just sort of, I don't know. That's where my eyeshadow will stop. I'll blend up with it. I like using my black. Blacks and browns right up here, I like this. I look at other eyeshadow ways to put on eyeshadow, but I always just go back to my same way, I guess because I'm comfortable with it. But anyway... This is the, the black is uh, 03, it's number 03. I don't remember what the name of it is. I had to look it up. And we have put together some really pretty collections I've been sharing on my stories. If y'all would like to go and look at the colors and, and the collections, they, they look really nice together. It's like a watermelon sugar is one of them. I always remember that because of the song, watermelon sugar. Uh, and then uh, it's just different little collections. Hey, Mary. Hey, Heather. Yeah, I got some black on my eye. Leah Joe. Okay, I'm going to go in with the purple. Purple is, it says 45F on the back of the purple. Like I said, I don't remember what colors, what the names of them were that I ordered them. I didn't write it down. But I really love my Lime Life eyeshadows because they are... So highly pigmented. And I know also I have my primer on. And once I put my finishing spray on, it's going to stay on as long as I want it to. 
that is a pretty purple though. And I just kind of tap most of the time. I don't want to get too much or too little. I just want to be able to build it perfect. Hey, Callie. Um, if you would push all those buttons down there, all those little... And hit a face or two, especially the S button. That helps so much. Drop me a comment. Tell me where you're watching from if you're a new watcher. Just some purple. Now, I, I like to put white on this side. Hey, Roxanne. Hey, Wanda. Y'all drop me some comments. Give me some hearts. Hit all the buttons. I'm going with white on the inside. I just like it like that. Thank you for the hearts. Can y'all believe it? I got off early enough today to actually take a shower. I used my new lounge hair product thing, my little waver, and do a live. And it's only $6.29. That is odd for me, y'all. Okay, I got those three colors, just black, the purple, and the white. And then I'll get my blender, and I just blend it all up. I start at the bottom and start blending up. Like I said, I'm getting, I'm, I'm, I have a Zoom, an opportunity Zoom tonight. If you are interested in maybe becoming a beauty guide full-time, part-time, Hey, Mr. Sewer, uh, if you could hit all those buttons, I would appreciate it so much. Send me some hearts. Help me move around. I'm so happy I see you on here. That, uh, that makes me happy. But anyway, if you have ever thought of uh, becoming a beauty guide and really being a beauty guide, like really working your business, not for the discounts, but for extra income... Um, send, draw me a message, send me a message, and I'll send you um, the code so you can get in and watch our opportunity soon with me. And I would, that would make me happy. That would be exciting there. I just blended all that together. And there we go. Heather is getting after it now. Go, Heather, spirit fingers. <laughs> I'm crazy, y'all. Okay, I'm going to go in with the AM in my waterline. It will help me to look more awake. I'm going to hold it down with my blender full. And since my phone is cracked, I'm looking back here behind it at my Ricky mirror. Which you can also get through Lum Life. My link's in my bio. This is AM. These are our dual-ended, double-ended eyeliner pencils. They are waterproof and smudge proof. You have about 15 seconds to work with them. And then, uh, Superwoman. I don't know what. Oh, Mary, thanks. I got the, the Lange La Wave. And I love it. I didn't take enough time. Look at that. I love it. I love it, too. Thank you. I, it is so hard doing stuff with my hair. I, I have naturally curly hair, and a lot of people think that's wonderful, and the people with naturally curly hair do not. It looks pretty sometimes when I first wake up, if I go to bed with a wet. J.D. used to call them darky, dookie curls. I lost my train of thought, y'all, so. But if you would like to go to the uh, Opportunity event, Zoom, y'all send me a message, and I'll give you the number. So you can join us. It it should be a good one. They're all really good. And I had to miss a lot of them. Because. Um, I'll be going with David to work. Like yesterday. We didn't even realize how late it was. It was after 7 o'clock when we left at Glenwood. So you know. What, what, what did we do? Nothing. Okay. I put the purple. Okay. This is the AM and PM. This came in a maze box. This is our dual-ended eyeliner I was talking about. It is waterproof and smudge-proof. I use the AM under my eye. And I'm going to use, this is the one that has powerful and 
pure gold I think yeah pure gold and powerful I'm going to use the powerful I, I mean I just use the powerful on top that's the purple one now I'm going to go in with my uh, making waves waterproof mascara I can see a glare I think it's because my phone is so cracked y'all it's like a little glare going on y'all deal with it I am going to go get me a new phone but this is making waves uh, waterproof mascara I suggest if you order the Making Waves waterproof mascara, you get makeup spray or makeup wipes because it will stay on for about three days if you don't want it to come off. More purple. Well, see, Heather, the thing is, um, when I look in my mirror, it's uh, it seems darker than it is in the phone. So, uh... I love purple too, but let me slap. Oh, okay. More purple eyeshadow. Let me get after it. I'll just put a little bit more. A little bit more just for you. Color scares me, don't you know, Heather? I'm more of a use some bronzer and a go. <laughs> Look, your mama saying no. Your mama said no, Heather. Depends on how old you are. There. Is that okay, Deborah? I put a little bit more for, but not too, too much. How about that? Okay. Now I'm going to put on my waterproof mascara. I had this under my leg because it goes on better to me warm too. Everything I love to warm up before I use it. Because when mama's not burning us out of the house, she's freezing us out of the house. And today was one of those days she was hot. So it's pretty cold in here. Nothing was warm. Oh, and our, our Making Waves uh, waterproof mascara, it has nourishing um, like vitamins in it. It nourishes your eyelashes. And my eyelashes, they seem to have gotten longer. I mean, they are really, they really be popping. I don't see any use for me needing false eyelashes. And I think it may be because I use the, the Making Waves so much. Because the Making Waves is the waterproof and I touch my eyes so much at work. I'll be sweating and rubbing my face or whatever. But look, look at that mascara. That's some good stuff. Is there a pink in the line my collection you use with the purple? Yes, there is a pink. I actually have Heather, what is that color right there? Let me that color right there. It was in one of the collections that Stephanie had put together, but I don't know what the name of it is. I usually just go with two colors. I'll use a black or a brown for my, you know, like my edges in the very top. And then I'll put in my color. I put white in the inside, though. I did put white on the inside corner. Y'all are trying to really dress me up, y'all. I'm just going to the living room. <laughs> Come on now. I don't know. Oh, let me see. The number is, this light pink is number, it was number 36. Sure is. It's number 36. I don't remember what the name of it was. So I, from now on, when I order eyeshadow, I'm going to write down the name. I didn't realize that they would deliver it to me and not have the name on it, so... Okay, my blush, I am going in with Alive. I have not worn Alive in a while. I used it, well, I used um, Excited on my eyes and my cheeks the other day. I hope there's none of that left on my blush brush. I really need to clean my brushes, y'all, which I, we have something for that, too. But I'm going to go in with this, my Alive. And I'm going to smile because I put it on my apples of my cheeks. The Alive is the, to me, it's the most nude, uh, buildable color that I have in blush, which I like. 
Because a lot of the times in the morning, if we're going to like pressure wash or something, and I, I just want to cover up, you know, just have some foundation on, I'll use my Alive because I, it doesn't have to be dark, you know. Sweet Dreams is the color of the pink. Okay, Deborah, Sweet Dreams is the color of the pink eyeshadow. Y'all see, I'm building this alive. It's making me look more alive. And that that's as far as I want to go, okay? That's as... When I hide the light a little bit. Well, no, I mean, it's not dark. It's just that's, that's how I want it to be, y'all. So there's my blush. Now, I did pick out my lipstick already. I'm going to put Berry Berry. This is my Enduring Lip Liner. It will last up to six hours. It is waterproof. In the summertime, I will use my Enduring Lip Liner for lipstick if I'm going somewhere and I'm going to be sweating or getting wet so that I know my lipstick will stay on. So, this is Berry Berry. If you have smaller lips, you can go above your cupid's bow just a little and then come down below on the bottom and it'll make you look like you have a bigger pout. I, I just follow my lips. I really like the Berry Berry. My favorites are Honey. Well, I like Honey, Cinnamon, and Dark Nude, but they're more of a, a nude color. But for the colors, Berry Berry is my favorite. I actually draw inside my lip line a little bit because I don't want my bottom lip to look as big as my bottom lip is. Oh, thanks, Deborah. Yeah, the blush that the blush was alive. I really like the alive because you can make it really nude color or you can make it really bright. It I really like that color a lot. Okay, my lipstick is going to be wedding cake. No ombre or fancy tonight. Just wedding cake. This is our enduring lip color. We have enduring lipstick also. Our enduring lip color will last up to six hours. But when you pull it out, you may have a lot on your wand. You want to wipe it off. And if you want more, just slowly uh, layer it. Because it goes on wet and smooth, but then it dries matte. And you want it to go on in thin layers so it'll dry. And then put some more on. And that will help it to stay up to six hours. I usually just use one dip anyway. I really love the wedding cake. I think it's so pretty. This is actually the color I used on Tasha's lips for her wedding was the wedding cake. And I thought it was so pretty. But you see it's wet. It went on so wet and smooth. And I let it dry. And um, then I'm going to put on my lip gloss. What color gloss did I have? I must have put it up. I don't think I decided on a lip gloss. I may just put on my... I'll put on Grace. I'm going to put on Grace over it because this is my newest purchase of my lip gloss. It is so pretty. Um, it... Which, Grace, you know, when you think of Grace, well, you think of soft and, you know, ladylike. And, well, it is. It is such a pretty color. I really love it. <laughs> oh, Grace. Okay. But, yeah, I really, I really love this Grace. I'm just trying to let my lips dry real good. I have a bad habit of not letting my enduring lip color dry and then putting my gloss on too fast. And I think it doesn't help the staying power you know it needs to dry i'm gonna put on the grace i don't know if it'll tame the color a little bit or not but we'll see i just i love the grace
Here's the pink you wanted, Deborah. We'll put the pink on the lips. How about that? Y'all remember the Amaze Box? Every month it goes on sale on the 5th and stop, it comes off sale on the 24th if we still have subscriptions available. So you want to jump on the Amaze Box train with me. It is great. It is great. The Amaze Box is, I love getting it once a month. It's like a present for myself and I think all of us women deserve one present every month something for us i really do so here's my look y'all what do y'all think how does it look look heather i even contoured my nose today <laughs> okay i will put on my time setter makeup finish spray and it will it will keep my makeup on for 16 hours there's no it will keep it on to up to this really does keep my makeup on. Uh, it, won't, it won't keep my lipstick on for 16 hours because it stays on up to 6 hours. But I got so much to say in a brief. Okay, yeah. Heather figured it up on her Amaze Boxes. She got $767 in free professional stuff. You know, professional um, skincare, makeup, brushes, all that. She got $767 in free professional stuff in there in the last year. So, uh, in the last year, she has saved $767. That is what the Amaze Box does. Thank you, Deborah. Okay, I'm going to put on my finishing spray now. Something I wish I would have had my whole life. Do you know how good this would have, how much this would have helped us in basketball, Heather? If we would have had some primer and finishing spray, we would have still had foundation on when we got done playing. But this is my look. And y'all, look, I got my Lange La Wave. I love it. I love it so much. I don't feel like my hair just looks so terrible. I, I like it. And look, look at that little curl. I'm loving this hair, y'all. I really do love it. I'm so proud of it. And, oh, thank you, Natasha. That is sweet. But here's my finished look. So I will look presentable on the Zoom. Usually when I'm on the Zoom, I just walked in the door from working all day. And I'll be looking scary. But I still turn that video camera on. Because... I don't know. I guess I want them to see I'm really there. But uh, Heather, it is worth it. It is worth it. I love it so much. I didn't. I didn't separate it. You know, cause I was trying to hurry up so I could do a live. I took spots about this big and did the the clamping on it. But like next time, I'll take the smaller. It says two inch. You know, like two inch uh, wide spaces in your hair and do it. But beware because. I did tap my forehead, and 400 degrees is pretty hot, and the top of my head might have a blister or two on it, because I got a little close. I'm not used to using stuff like that, so, but anyway, okay, I will stop talking, and um, I have time to go watch Young and the Restless that is recorded before the Zoom starts, so my whole evening is just getting better and better. Thanks for watching. If you watch this on replay... Please drop a comment, drop replay, and touch all the buttons you see. It helps me so much. And I have a business page. I'll share this to my business page. Last time I did my live on my business page. But it's called Jessica's Beauty Mark. With a K. Jessica's Beauty Mark. David made up the name. So, um, y'all head on over there and like my page if you haven't already. Yeah, and I'm trying to invite people, but I'm scared I may invite too many people because Facebook is weird about that. I didn't want to get, you know, like put in Facebook jail for inviting too many people at a time. So if I haven't reached you yet, please go to Jessica's Beauty Mark and like my page and my stuff will be on there too. Uh, I'm going to go watch Young and Restless and then I'm going to do a Zoom. And I'm going to go to sleep and then I'm going to get up and do it all over again. 
But I love y'all, and thanks for thanks for staying on here and watching me. Um, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye. I said bye, but y'all know what? I hit the finish, and uh, the messages popped up. So now goodbye. I'm gonna try to hit the finish button.